For decades, scientists have gazed into the vast darkness of space, asking one haunting question. Are we alone? The SETI program, short for Search for Extraterrestrial Intelligence, was born from that timeless curiosity. Founded in the 1960s, SETI uses massive radio telescopes, like the Allen Telescope Array in California, to scan the skies for faint signals patterns or pulses that might reveal intelligent life beyond Earth. The idea is simple, just as Earth broadcasts countless radio waves into space, an advanced civilization might do the same, intentionally or not. By detecting a non-random signal, one that carries structure, repetition, or coded information, SETI hopes to find evidence of intelligence beyond Earth. And there have been moments that shook the scientific world. In 1977, astronomer Jerry Amon recorded the famous WOW signal, a mysterious burst from the constellation Sagittarius, lasting just 72 seconds. It was so precise and powerful that Amon circled it on the data printout and wrote WOW beside it. To this day, no one has explained what caused it. SETI's search has evolved. Today, with help from AI algorithms and supercomputers, scientists process data from billions of stars, listening across millions of radio frequencies. Programs like Breakthrough Listen, funded by billionaire Yuri Milner and supported by Stephen Hawking, have expanded the mission to unprecedented scale, scanning the nearest one million stars for alien transmissions. Yet despite decades of silence, the search continues. As SETI pioneer Carl Sagan once said, the universe is a pretty big place. If it's just us, it seems like an awful waste of space. Thank you for joining Strange Mystery World. If you find the video helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe to the channel, and turn on the notification bell to motivate me to create more videos and not miss out on the interesting things behind Strange Mystery World. See you in the next video.